Safety Tips for Machine and Equipment Part 1 It is critical to comprehend why machine and equipment safe measures are required. The location of the safeguards on the machines should be communicated to the operator or maintenance worker, as well as information on why the safeguards exist and what hazards they defend against. An operator or maintenance worker should also be instructed on how to remove machine and equipment safety guards, as well as under what conditions guards can be removed. Workers must be taught what to do if they detect guards that are damaged, missing, or insufficient. A dress code should be presented to an operator or maintenance worker. No loose-fitting clothing or jewelry, for example. These objects could easily become entangled in the machinery or equipment. Any piece of equipment, from the simplest hand tool to the most complicated machinery, has operational safety risks. Hazards of machines and equipment Electrical hazards Each piece of equipment that uses electricity as a power source has a risk of electrocution. Look for exposed wires or broken sections in power cords, switches, and connectors. Caught in hazards amputation Machine guards are mounted on machinery to keep our employees safe from moving parts. They will, of course, no longer provide protection if they have been removed during maintenance or adjustment. Every day, inspect the equipment to confirm that all guards are in place. Chemical hazards Processing equipment that employs chemicals can provide a variety of risks. Leaks can result in slipping dangers as well as probable chemical exposure. Vapors from leaking hoses could cause respiratory problems. For more information call 469-370-7501 or visit interstateheavyequipment.com.